First, you need seed starting containers. Small plastic cups or pots work best. Then, fill your container of choice with potting mix, ensuring that it's crumbly and without chunks. I add some perlite to the cup and mix it into the top layer. This creates a loose environment that will help the seeds root better. I use a heating mat because consistent heat is critical for good germination. Around 85 degrees Fahrenheit or 29.4 degrees Celsius is ideal for peppers. I pre-moisten the potting soil in the cups by bottom watering as shown. Once you have your pepper seeds, place them in the refrigerator for three days. This mimics winter temperatures, and when the seeds get removed, they will sense that it is spring and be more likely to germinate. Now it's time to make some tea. I recommend orange pico for this, but any type of black tea should work. Let it cool down a bit and stir well. Ha! You spilled some! Oh! <laughs> Pour the pepper seeds into the tea and let them soak for 30 minutes. This softens the seed shells, speeding germination. Once 30 minutes has passed, it's time to drain the tea. To do this, I use coffee filters. These ones are made out of bamboo and are quite expensive. Sorry mom and dad. Place a filter over the mug, ensuring a good seal. Then turn the mug upside down over the sink and let all the tea drain out, leaving the seeds behind in the filter. Now that you have everything prepared, it's time to plant your pepper seeds. Sprinkle the seeds on top of the soil and try to place them fairly evenly apart. You don't have to be perfect because you'll be transplanting the seedlings later on. Next, I sprinkle a mixture of 25% perlite, 25% vermiculite, and 50% potting soil onto the surface of each cup, adding just enough to cover all the seeds. Now spray the tops with some lukewarm water to contact the pepper seeds with moisture. The soil should be moist to the touch, but not soggy in order to avoid mold, which would not be good. You're almost there now. All you have left to do is cover the containers with plastic. Here I'm using plastic bags, but clear plastic domes or saran wrap works just as well. Only eight days later, the peppers are germinating. Congratulations. You now know how to start peppers indoors for super quick, high germination rates. Good luck on your pepper growing journey. I know you can do it. Thank you so much for watching, and as always, grow it best.